you guys back to the channel today we're going to be looking at some new updates coming to prodigy so let's get into the video all right so first off it looks like shipwreck short is going to be updated and some parts of it have already been updated so let's go ahead and head over there and check out some of them so some of the parts that are underwater along with some of the like wooden parts right here you can see this dock does appear to be updated um some of the shells also were updated the trees appear to be updated as well, and these, um, like, barrels here also look like they're updated. The water in the sand doesn't seem like it was updated, but pretty much everything else was. So, we're gonna go ahead and take a look around. I'm pretty sure that the bubble that you're inside of was updated. You can see that some of these stuff down here does look like it was updated. Um, the bubble is supposed to be HD now, so... Those are a few of the things that were updated. There are also some houses inside of like the water areas. Also, this anchor was updated to be HD. So we are going to go ahead and try to make our way over to some of the houses. And on the way, we see that this ship is now HD as well. So we're going to have to do some battles and we'll get over to some of the other areas. All right, so as we head up here, we should see some more stuff that will be updated to HD. So yeah, you can see the rest of this ship is HD. Um, still the sand water is not, and it doesn't really look like anything else changed too much. So we're going to continue up here, and I don't think that anything would be updated up here. For some reason, there's a ch unopened chest. I don't know if I should press it, because I kind of feel like there's going to be a mimic in there. So we're just not going to open it, and we'll continue over this way. Also, there was something that was updated in battle that we're going to go ahead and check out here. So if I do this spell, it'll say weak, I believe. Okay, no, it didn't. It, yeah, it did say resist there. So that is something that they did add. There's also one for strong, which we're probably going to need for my opponent to actually hit me. So you can see, if it's a resist, it'll be blue. So that is something that they added. I don't know what color the powerful is. So we're going to have to see if Muckeye can do a powerful hit right here on us so that we can actually see what it looks like. So yeah, there it is. Powerful right there. And it just looks sort of like a critical hit, except it doesn't have the uh, like orange background in the back. So, you can see that it's blue to show that it's a weak, and I assume that will probably win the battle right here. So, let's go ahead and head over here, and I think this is where we will see some of the updated buildings. Yeah, so you can see these buildings are updated. Jelly Jim also did get a spine in the code, except you can't really, or he didn't actually get updated, he still rast- or, uh, I don't know what the opposite of rasterized is, um, but he still looks like that. The sand pits down here are now HD. For some reason, they're gray instead of uh, tan like they used to be. I think that I'm probably going to have to do two battles in this area, so I'll see you guys once I finish them. All right, so we're just going to head up here. What we're looking for is a gray building. Um, I don't know where they actually are located so it could be a while before i actually find one i'm gonna have to do a lot of battles here so i'm probably just gonna go ahead and skip to when i actually find these gray buildings all right so i haven't found the area yet that has these gray buildings but um well i was gonna show you but i just got into a battle. Alright, so what I was trying to show you guys in this area is that these things are sort of glowing up. I think it looks really cool. Also, the ships look really nice as well. So, this area looks really nice. Um, also, I think something that they did do is, like, increase the spawn rate of enemies, because I am facing a lot. So, yeah, I don't know if they are just releasing this as the final version of Shipwreck Shore because the ground, like the path in the sand doesn't look like it's fully in uh, HD, but everything else pretty much seems like it's finished. They added the increased enemy spawning. Anything that is pretty much that they've added 
into the updated areas they pretty much added into shipwreck shore besides for these like just few things so that's kind of interesting i don't know if they're planning to do anything else because the sand definitely needs to get updated but i think we'll just have to wait to see if that does happen so yeah it turns out these gray ones don't exist but we will be going ahead and looking at them a little later in the video so let's go ahead and look at some of the files that were added into the game all right so first off we have some stuff that we've already seen this is the updated bubble this is called um spine shipwreck bubble so nothing too interesting here we also have spine shipwreck squeak this wasn't updated at all but it was added as a spine before i think it was just an atlas this is the same for the shipwreck tornado the same for the shipwreck whirlpool the same for eve and jelly jam as well and so then here is the zone uh atlas so this is like stuff that's in the game you can see two of the newest things we have this uh like sand pit right here and then the new camera which i believe that we're going to see in this next image yeah so this is just called camera map and yeah this is what it's going to look like or it should already be in the game um you just can't see it if you've already completed shipwreck shore so yeah that's why i didn't show it in just like in game now we also have the sand shortcut which we've already seen now a few other things that were updated we have the icon key 15 so this is one of the key items in the game um, I think this is like the Sonic Blaster or something like that. So this got updated to be HD. I believe I have the icon of what it used to look like. So yeah, it used to look like this. Now it looks like this. So it just got updated to be HD. And that's the same for the camera. So this is what its icon looks like now. And this is what its icon used to look like. So just updated to HD as well. Now we also have some weird things that I don't know why these were added. This is called Ink Ball. Um, it's not really anything special. We also have Ink Blob 1, which isn't special as well. And we also have Ink Blob 2, which is just a darker version of Ink Blob 1. We also have this Particle Bubble Shipwreck, which just looks like a normal bubble. And yeah, those are all the stuff that was added from Shipwreck. Now we have some stuff that's for something called restrictions. I think it's sort of related to hard mode, but I'm not really 100% sure. So this is called restriction card background green. So it's just a green background. And then there's also like a red one, which is right here. Um, I think it's only red and green. I don't know what they're going to be used for. But we also have some like backgrounds, which this one's called Restriction Banner, Background Puppet Master. There's one for Bonfire, one for Firefly Forest, Shipwreck Shore. All of the islands have one along with the Puppet Master battle. And then there's also like just a boss that will show up for every single one. So this one's called Restriction Banner, Sebelini. So there's one for Sebelini. There's going to be ones for the Cloaked Wizards. So when you're battling the Cloaked Wizards, you'll see these restrictions as well. And then there's also one for a hard version of Sebelini. So this is the what this this would be the one that you see when you're in the academy, um, the bosses that you fight before the puppet master. And the puppet master is also gonna have one as we had talked about. Now we have this one which is called Restriction Banner Hard Mode. So I don't know where this is going to be used, because there isn't really any specific battle for hard mode unless there will be one that we don't know about yet. Um, and then here is the Restriction Banner Puppet Master one that I had talked about. I think that it looks really cool. We also have titles that will be at the bottom, which will look like this. It'll just be the verses and then the name of the boss that you're fighting. So there's one for Cloak Wizard, one for Sevelini, one for Puppet Master, all of those. And then we have this banner wave, which I assume if I can find one of the images. Yeah, here, this would just be like covering this. So this thing would just be like in front of it. Now there are going to be different colors of this. There's going to be like orange, purple, all the other colors like green, blue. Now we also have these ones, which are weird. This is called restriction free merge. 
Um, I don't know why there's a restriction for this. All the other ones seem to be battle related, like you wouldn't be able to use like some version of a pet. Like maybe you're not allowed to use epics for a battle. You're not allowed to use fire pets for a battle. Those would make sense as restrictions. Maybe they're saying that you can't use merged pets, but this is sort of making it seem like you can't merge pets at all, which, or, and it's called free merge, so it sort of feels like you just don't get to use your free merged pet. I'm not really sure about this one. And then we also have restriction free rescue, which I don't know what this one's supposed to be for either. Um, they can't just not let you use pets that you've rescued because pretty much everyone has all their pets are just rescued. So I don't really know how this is going to work. Um, next up, we have some tile sets for um, uh, the underwater. So you can see this is like the gray buildings that I was talking about. There's like a bunch of gray stuff in here. Um, and then one of the things that I think is interesting, Billyfoot seems to sort of have been updated to HD. You can see right here, pretty much every single one that we've seen has been pixelated besides for this one. So that is pretty interesting. I don't know if this one was added into the game because it is called single images. Normally this would be set as an asset or an atlas or a tile set. So it's weird that it's set as a single images. Now we also have a tile set. So this is actually in the game. So you can see that this is just the ship that's in the second area in uh, shipwreck shore nothing too new here we also have this which is like the insides this is called tile set ship interior so when you're going inside of the ships this is what you'd see we also have tile set water new so maybe they did update the sand and i just didn't notice because it does look like they updated the water and the grass and the sand are supposed to have been updated I just did not notice any of those actually being updated, so I don't truly really know. Also, um, this is not in the game, this pit, so I don't know why that's actually here. And then we have an update to the Firefly tile set. It's nothing major, just like one single change, which is right here. This thing was here, now it's not, so you can just see here and this is the older version of it this is the newer so this was added for some reason i don't know why and then i think yeah just i was going to talk about this but we saw it in game just the critical stuff was added and then the final thing we have two things that were added into the data so we have pet screen has no evos this pet cannot be evolved so this is going to be in the new pet book telling you that you cannot evolve pets because they don't have evolutions. And then it says too many pets, you have too many pets, you must merge some before you can rescue anymore. So it looks like you're go not going to have like a set pet cap like they used to or they're going to greatly increase it. Um, and if you have too many pets, you can just merge them to get less pets so you can catch more and i'm pretty sure that they're going to be removing the ability to release pets with the addition of the new pet book system so yeah that is something to keep an eye out for but yeah that is pretty much everything that was added today so that is going to go ahead and end the video if you guys enjoyed make sure to like and subscribe and bye